Are you looking for the ultimate cheat code for your videos? Well, in this video, I'm gonna be showing you exactly that. Plugins in editing can be a vital part to speeding up your editing process while also maintaining that level of professionalism. In this video, I'm gonna be looking at Motion VFX, one of the greatest plugin providers out there. I'm so glad they reached out to me. I'm looking forward to it. This video is gonna be fun. My name's Dan, you're watching Dan Vinci. Let's jump into it. Hey, what's up? Uncle DHD here. Welcome to the official MKBHD Motion VFX plugin. Peace. All right then guys, so welcome to the second sponsored video on the channel. Really, really proud of myself to be saying that already. This video is entirely sponsored by Motion VFX. All right, so we're in DaVinci Resolve now. Let's look at this plugin. Now, the specific plugin that we're gonna be looking at today from Motion VFX, there are so many, I'm not gonna to touch upon everything because we die. We're gonna be looking at the MKBHD plugin. Welcome to my first video. If you haven't heard, MKBHD, D. Uncle BHD here. He's a popular YouTuber, specifically a tech YouTuber that I've watched for years. And he's made a pack for your videos. So you can really emulate his style and you can actually customize these a little bit. So you can create your own thing. So it won't exactly look like you're copying him because that would be a bit awkward. But let's jump in and have a look at, let's say the transitions first. So if you go into the toolbox and search MKBHD. Everything in this pack will show up once you've installed it in your toolbar, basically your toolbox. So if we scroll down here to the very bottom, we've got transitions. So what we can do is just drag one over like transitions here. As you can see, I've not got a particularly powerful computer, but this does run all right. Look at that. That's, that's pretty clean. Pretty clean. Squeaky clean. As you can see, we can change some things. Let's change some things, shall we? Make, the, make it blue. A beautiful blue passport. Blue passport. There you go. Blue. Clean transition, just like that. Now, of course, there's six transitions and and here's some of them on your screen right now. Wow. Amazing. That's so cool. Wow. <laughs> I'm joking, they are really, really good. Oh, a little box. No way. That's, that's cute. Don't really know when you would want this or where you would want this. Check mark. Oh, it's for like highlighting stuff. Can you move it around? Of course you can. Okay, so we could do this. This man's head. Yes. I'm having too much fun. Let's move on. So it looks like there's certainly some pointers here. Now, these would be fairly useful, I think, for, let's say, highlighting a specific product. If you're doing a video and there's lots of things on screen and you want your audience to look at something very specific, these certainly would work and there's, there's there's five good ones here now that's good so the pack does come with titles now i've had bad experiences with titles in plugins before in the past plugins tend to have custom fonts and when you install them the fonts don't necessarily work when i've installed this everything seems to work with other plugins in the past when you type in something and you put large amounts of text it sort of breaks i don't know how to show this maybe i'll show it with some other plugins but this doesn't do this which is really really useful and not bad actually there you go and then we'll add the text oh my god this is great and then i'm gonna i'm the train go choo choo i'm a very professional man as you know <laughs> the train the train go choo choo roll the thomas the tank engine music but this is really clean and I, I mean i can customize the color size tracking line spacing everything that you need so let's make that yellow and then we could add a marker that's it let's add a marker hello mark oh hi mark let's move you around can we rotate you of course we can rotate you we can do everything moving on okay so arguably the most impressive thing about the mkbhd plugin is the intros you get five intros which doesn't sound like a lot when you dive into it you realize that there is a lot of customizability here to the point where you can actually put your own logo in and make it just look fantastic yeah baby so scrolling down there's a little category called intros here so if we drag in intro number one like this and play it back here you can see here that your logo would go there and it actually looks really really clean really really nice so let's jump into the inspector tab and customize a few things this is the bit that i've been wanting to show you so if you click on browse here you can literally put any logo that you want so i'm going to put my own logo in let's find it where are you i will find you i will find you and i will kill you no, that's the Geekwatt logo. I don't want the Geekwatt. Well, okay, all right, I'm doing it. I'm, I can't find my own logo, but I'm putting the Geekwatt logo in. James, if you're watching this, I'm sorry. I'm stealing your graphics. <laughs> Please don't fire me. All right, let's quickly change this to Geekwatt. Oh my gosh, so it animates the logo in just like that. Oh, you see that? That must be using the edge effect. Okay, so let's change a few things. So let's make the geek what? Yeah, blue. And then let's make, can we make the background blue? Elements. Oh, yeah. And then can we change the lines? So I'm going to change the lines in, the transition here. Oh, yeah. Look at that. That's sick. If you're liking this plugin, I'll link in the description below some links to the plugins that I'm using and some of the plugins I've been sent. I might cover some more of these if you guys like these videos. This is clean. Like, this is really, really clean. 
explain. And as long as I don't get fired, please don't fire me, James. I'm going to keep this. This is really, really cool. Okay, so now that we've looked at intros, let's skip along some other things very quickly and show you exactly what else this plugin has. So this plugin has a features section. These are like featured graphics. So let's say you want to summarize some of the supported features for a product. The animations in these are clean. And of course, you have the call to actions. You've got to have them in a plugin. I mean, all of them do. The subscribe looks nice. Again, you can drag these down. Oh, that's nice. New video. I might use that. that is, that's nice. <laughs> and then, of course, the backgrounds. You've got to have backgrounds. These are really, really clean. As you can see on screen, you can customize them in various different ways. Like with all the other bits and bobs that I've shown you already, you just go into the inspector tab and you can just quickly change things and make them your own. You've also got this additional footage animation, which I find really useful if you want to layer stuff on top like this. They look pretty cool. Okay, well, that's pretty much all I've got time for for today. I know it's been a bit of a short one, but I hope you've gauged and understood how good this plugin is. This plugin is about 99 US dollars, I believe. You pay a high price, but you do get a high quality product in return. So if you're willing to part with your cash, you will not be disappointed with this. Future Dan here. All right, guys, so I have actually got a promo code for this. And if you want 10% off this plugin, just type in DanVinci10, the, the thing on screen right now, and you'll get money off this plugin. Look at me, saving you money. I'll be soon saving you money on your car and your kitchen and uh, your lawn and, you know, Dan Vinci codes for everyone, but not yet. Just plugins for now. That was a joke. Please don't. That was a joke. I hope you've enjoyed it. My name's Dan. You've watched Dan Vinci and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.